today we are going to do a 35 minute bar pilates for the last few weeks we are starting with 20 minutes 30 minute bar pilates workout and today it's gonna be a longer version of 35 minutes workout but if you feel like you just want a gentle version please feel free to come back to the previous one and do that otherwise just follow along with this one because it's gonna be so much fun and different movements and before we start i just wanted to say thank you so much for your support and to be here with me to do this series i hope you enjoyed it truly and if you're ready just roll your mat and let's do this together hey love you got your heart on your sleeve but the shirt on your back's a bit small Change in the world ain't half bad after all. All right, and then let's start by doing some warm up before the main workout. So I want you to stand in your most comfortable position, arms along the body, relax your shoulders, and relax your hands, your feet, your whole body here. Now I want you to inhale and lengthen the spine, open the chest, close the eyes, gently pull the belly button in. I want you to stay here just for a couple of seconds before we do the deep breath. Feel how your body feeling at this moment and listen to the sound that it might have around your surrounding. Inhale deeply and exhale deeply. Inhale, focus on your breath and exhale. Inhale, get all the air into your lungs. Exhale, get all the air out of your lungs through the mouth. And one more deep breath. And exhale deeply. Inhale. And exhale. That's awesome. And now I want to Open your legs if width apart, keep your feet parallel to each other. Now inhale, bring your head to one side. And exhale, bring your head back to the opposite side. And back to the center. And a couple more times each side. <sighs> to the opposite one. Feel the side of your neck is stretching. Slowly with your own pace. And now for the last one, go all the way, hold it here and use your hand to pull the head a little bit further, relax your opposite one. And come back to the other side. And back to the center. Look up. And look down. Inhale. And exhale, slowly relax your head. One more time. And slowly bring your head back to the center. Now rotate your head around your neck. Inhale halfway, exhale halfway, and then reverse. And one more round. And reverse. And slowly bring your head back. Open your arm to the side. Inhale and slowly lean on one side. Exhale, come back to the opposite side. Your hips still stabilized. Feel the side of your body is lengthening. And back to the center. Inhale. Exhale deeply. And a couple more times with your own breath. Keep breathing. Come back to the other side. Reach and back to the center. Lengthen. Open the chest. Two. And last one. To the opposite. And slowly bring your hands down. Rotate your shoulders fully to far directions. Now 
lengthen your arms, soften your elbows, round your spine, bring your hands forward and open your chest, arms like what? And then round and inhale, open. And exhale, round and inhale. With your own pace. And one more time. And slowly bring your hands down, rotate the wrist, reverse. Now I want to inhale, rotate the ankle, and then reverse to the opposite side, and reverse. Good. And now inhale, lift your toes up, one side of your foot and to the opposite side, soften your knee, come back, now step one foot forward and flex the ankle, feel the back of your leg is stretching, and to the opposite side, back to the center, and now inhale, bring your hand to hug the foot and move backward, and then come back. Feel free to use your hand to put it on the wall if it helps with the balance. Otherwise, just gently pull the belly button in and find a balance on your foot. Inhale and exhale. And one more time. Feel the front of your thigh is stretching and come back. Foot down to the mat. Inhale deeply and exhale deeply to your mouth. Now bring big circle with your arms. Inhale deeply, exhale deeply. And then reverse. And now shake your hands. All right, and we are going to start the main workout from here. So I wanted to inhale, start with your V stands. Keep your heels hip width apart and now inhale slowly bend your knees down exhale bring it back shoulders stabilized here at the same place don't make any tension on your shoulders i'm gonna try to bring your knee down and lift it up and inhale and exhale a couple more times try to go lower if you can come back nine eight seven that's awesome. Six. Keep breathing. And five. Four. Good. Three. And two. And last one. Alright. And now slowly inhale. Shift your hips to one side. Come back to the opposite side and back to the center. For more challenging, open your arm to the side. Slide. Come back to the opposite side and put your whole feet down. It's just a tiny movement but I wanted to kind of get away with how a very small part of your body move in the movement to get you ready for the whole workout. Keep breathing. Awesome. And one more time each side. All right, and now I wanted to slowly bring your hands down, rotate your shoulders fully, and then reverse. Good, and now inhale, put your whole foot down, open wider than the hips if it helps with the balance. And now slowly bend your knees, bring your hips down, bring your hands down, and now open your arm to one side, come back to the opposite side, and back to the center, stand up, down, Open, come back to the other side and back and lift up. And a couple more times to each side. Listen to your body. You can open your knee wider if it's easier for the balance. Keep breathing. <sighs> Lengthen and then down. Use a breath to control the movement.
squeeze your inner thighs, pull the belly button in. And three. Lengthen. Two. Good. Last one. And lengthen and slowly bring your hands up. Gently shake your hips, take a deep inhalation. And exhale deeply through your mouth. Bring your hips from left to right. And then reverse. Awesome. Inhale slowly, sit all the way down. Bring the hips low, as low as you can. Bring your arm to the front, pull the belly button all the way in. And from here, bring your hands down all the way to the mat. Or if you need to lift your hips up and bring your hands down, if it's easier for you, just listen to your body and do what you feel good. Make sure you engage the abs here. And I want to inhale, lift one heel up and down to the opposite side, come back. Now, if it's too challenging for you to put your hands down, the other way you can do it, you just keep your hands here, engage your abs, and lift on heel up and down to the opposite side and come back. We're gonna, come, we're gonna do it a couple more times with your own breath, slowly, and five, to the other side, four, squeeze your booty, pull the belly button in, lengthen the neck, three, good, and two, and last one, I feel like my whole legs are shaking and lengthen your legs. Inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. And one more deep breath and exhale deeply. Good. And then slowly bring your feet back to the center. Good. And now I'm going to inhale, lift your arms all the way up, keep your feet together. Slowly pull the belly button in. Now, if you feel like it's easier for you to balance in your body, we we'll open your legs, see if we get apart. So you can see me doing one foot. Sit all the way down, arms up, and then lengthening all the way up. You can do it a little bit quicker if it's easier for you. So inhale and exhale. Or easier version, open your legs, see if we get apart. Just sit low as you can and feel good with the knee and listen to your body. Awesome. And five, engage the abs. Four. Three, keep breathing. Come back. Oh, challenging version. Feet together, two. Good. It's so much more difficult to keep balance when you put your feet like this. Slowly bring your hands down. Gently show your hips. Take a deep breath. That's awesome, guys. Exhale deeply through the mouth. Keep your body another deep inhalation. And exhale deeply. All right. And now we are going to come to the other movement today. Shift your weight to one side. Lengthen your leg to the opposite side. Arms to the front. And now inhale slowly. Kick your leg backward and then bend your knee towards the chest and kick and then come back go all the way back in the side exhale come back pull the belly button in and seven more times on this side six engage your abs and five feel your obliques when you bring your leg backward into the side like that three two Use a breath to lead the movement. And last one. And slowly bring your foot down. Shift your weight to the opposite side again. Knee to the front and to the side. Open all the way backward. Exhale and inhale. And seven more times. Stabilize your shoulders. Don't lift your shoulders up and make it intense. So, and inhale, lengthen, and come back. And three, two, and last one. And slowly bring your feet down, gently shake your hips, 
Take a deep breath, inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Good. Now, lift one leg up again to 90 degree here. Hold it here. Arm to the front of your chest. Rotate and bring it back. Extend the ankle. Inhale and exhale. Your hips still stabilized and facing forward. Only your torso is moving. Easier version, put your foot on the opposite one. Just rest there. And five, come back. Four, keep breathing. Three, awesome. And two, and last one. And slowly to the opposite side. Come back. And exhale. Seven more times. Put your foot on top of the other one. Inhale. Put it deeply. And last one. Oh, and slowly bring your foot down. Alright, now if you have a chair here, please feel free to take it here with you so in case we need it for support. Alright, now open your legs here with the pad. Shift your torso to one side, soften the knee here. And I want to inhale, lift your arms all the way up, soften the elbow. Lean on one side, lift your leg up and down. If you're using a chair here, feel free to just lift and down and rotate to one side. So it's pretty similar, lift and down. Come back, good. And five, four, three, awesome. Two, and last one. And we're gonna go to the opposite side again. Inhale, flex the ankle, lift it up and down, nine, eight, seven, good, six, keep breathing, and five, four, three, pull the belly button in, and last one, and slowly lengthen, bring your hands down, gently shake your hips, take a deep breath, inhale deeply through your nose, and exhale deeply through your mouth. Good. And I wanted to allow yourself to come to the middle of the mat. Now, use a chair if you need to for support. Otherwise, just bring your hands to the front and try to find balance using your abs. Inhale, lean backward, engage your abs. Keep your whole weight on one foot. Lift your leg high. Pull the belly button in and higher. Pull the belly button all the way in, engage your abs and start to make a little pull slowly for 10, 9, 8, 7, extend the ankle, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and then flex the ankle and 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1, awesome, and I wanted to inhale, extend the ankle again, Draw a tiny circle here for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, and 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1, and then reverse for 10, engage your abs, 8, and 7, 6, keep breathing, 4, 3, 2, and 1, and slowly bring your foot down, switch to the opposite side, so we're going to do the same thing, lift it up, and 10, make a little pause, 8, 7, 6, belly button all the way in, and 3, 2, and 1, engage your abs as much as possible, flex the ankle, and 10, 9, 8, and 7, 6, keep breathing, 4, 3, 2, 1, and now extend the ankle again, start to make a tiny circle, and 10, 9, 8, and 7, 6, soften the knee, Four, three, two, and one, and slowly bring your foot back. Round your spine and arch your back, and round. 
and roll all the way down to the mat to keep a little stretch on the lower back here gently shake your hips and come back slowly shoulders lengthening inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth all right now you want to step one foot forward and one leg backward and now slowly bend your knee here at 90 degree pull the belly button in now use your hand to support on the chair we probably need the wall or the chair to support so inhale lift your leg up high and down and up and down eight seven keep breathing engage your abs as much as possible flex your torso forward to support your lower back three awesome two and last one lengthen your leg and bend and lengthen eight seven six and five four belly button in three good so tall two definitely need the support from the tray last one and switch to the opposite side here so we're gonna do the same thing step backward so that way your knee on top of the ankle and then shift your weight to the front make your leg high and low and nine eight seven keep breathing six and five four good three two and last one and now i wanted to inhale lengthen your leg and down and lengthen and down and eight more times yeah, with your own breath seven six use the breath to control the movement of your knee and your leg four three you don't have to go so low just to the point you feel good with the lower back last one and slowly bring your feet down take a deep inhalation and exhale deeply through your mouth all right and now i wanted to allow yourself to inhale slowly go to one side of the mat so that way when you move your leg forward and backward you don't kick the chair here now i wanted to inhale slowly lift your leg all the way up lengthen the spine engage your abs as much as possible lengthen your leg make a little kick here seven six five four three two one and slowly bend move all the way back what ten nine eight seven six five four three two and one and slowly bend your knee now we're going to do the same thing but this time bend your knee here flex the ankle and lengthen and ten nine eight seven six five four three two and one and bend and lengthen all the way backward ten nine eight seven six five four three two and one and slowly bend your knee to the opposite side so inhale extend the ankle lengthen and ten nine eight seven six five four three two and one and all the way backward and ten nine eight seven six five four three two one and come back flex the ankle you can try to keep your hands on the waist if it's easier for you to keep the balance without using the tray three two and one and then all the way back one and ten nine eight seven six engage your abs two and one and slowly come back all right and now i wanted to allow yourself to inhale soften your knees and lift your heels up and down and nine just keep your weight on one side eight and seven good six keep breathing more challenging hand behind your head and four three two and last one and now inhale lengthen your leg all the way to the side pull the belly button in and lift and down engage your abs as much as possible good seven six and five four three don't have to keep your leg so high two and last one and slowly bring your leg down we're gonna go to the opposite side ten good nine eight and seven six keep breathing and five four awesome three two and last one and now slowly lengthen 
your leg to the side and go to up, pull the belly button in and heel up and down. Nine, eight, and seven. Keep breathing. Six, and five, four. Awesome. Three, two, and last one. It is really challenging. Bring your foot down, shake your hips, take a deep breath. Inhale deeply to your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. Good. And now for the next move, I want you to stand in the middle of the mat again. Now inhale and lift your legs all, your arms all the way up to the ceiling. And then slowly exhale, round your spine and bring your hands backward. Inhale, lift your legs up. And exhale, bend your elbows backward. And then come back, lift your leg all the way up and all the way backward again. You can use the hand to put on the tray if it helps with. Just lengthen your arm and your leg in this movement. All the way back, lift, and all the way backward. Good. And up, and backward. And up, and back. And three. Oh, use your core to lift and give yourself the balance. Two. And last one. Exhale, lift your leg to the front and inhale backward. And slowly bring your foot down. We're going to move to the opposite side again. Use a try if you need to. And inhale, lengthen. And exhale all the way backward. And nine. Keep breathing. Eight. And seven. Good. Six. And five. Lengthen all the way. Come back. Four. And three. Keep breathing. And two more times. And last one. Inhale. And exhale. And slowly bring your hands down. Shake your hips. Take a deep breath. Inhale deeply through your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. All right. We are going to start the pull down. So, come to the middle of the mat, hands on the knees, gently shake your hips, lengthen the spine, arch your back, cat and cow in sitting position, and round your spine, inhale, and exhale, and two more times, and last one, and a switch to the opposite side. We're going to do the same thing, five, four, three, and two, and last one, and then slowly lengthen, and then open your leg as wide as you can, flex the ankle, and then extend, and flex, and extend. Go to one side. Knee high go. And lengthen your leg as far as you want. And feel good. And to the opposite side. Hold it here for a couple seconds. Knee high go. And then down all the way. And slowly bring it back. Walk your hands forward. Gently shake your hips. Go as far as you can. And then walk your hands all the way back. Awesome. And now oh, inhale, bend one knee. And flex your body down to the mat. You can rest your head here. Hold it for five, four, three, two, one. And go to the opposite side. Hold it here for five, four, three, two, 
in one and slowly bring it back awesome and now the next movement I wanted to come to on four position lengthen your leg flex the ankle move your heel backwards so you feel the back of your lower leg is stretching and make a little pulse here to really feel good and then come back one more time and bring it back to the center now bring your heels to one side and to the opposite side and come back a couple more times and slowly to the opposite side flex the ankle move backward make a little pose and come back and move all the way backward again make a little pose and back to the center bring your heel from left to right and slowly bring your knee back to the center rotate the ankles and then reverse and now I want to inhale come to try pose rest your head down on the mat take a deep inhalation and exhale deeply through your mouth now keep your arm along the body Rest your arms, relax. Inhale. And exhale again. And now interlace your fingers behind your back. Up your arms all the way up to the ceiling. Make a little pose towards the head. And three, two, one. Elbows bend, bring your hands down to the back. Open your elbows to the sides. Gently shake your hips from left to right. Do it slowly and within the range of the movement that you can do. Listen to your body. Inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. And inhale. Exhale, let go of the hands. Bring it neck to the knees. Allow yourself slowly coming up to sitting position. You can sit on your heels or you can sit all the way down and cross the legs if it's more comfortable with you. I'm going to spend a couple of seconds here just for deep breath. Inhale deeply, hands on the knees or the thighs where you feel comfortable. Exhale deeply, close the eyes. Inhale and exhale deeply. couple more times here just I wanted to focus completely on your breath at this moment following the breath inhale all the way into the side and the back of your body and exhale get all the way out gently around your spine just as the neutral of the breath inhale open the chest and exhale everything is just a tiny movement and the most important thing is focusing on your breath at this moment. Inhale and exhale and hear your own breath. So take a deep one, listen to your breath and inhale, lengthen the spine. Relax your shoulders, checks from your head to the toes. Relax your forehead, your cheekbones, your jaw, your neck, your shoulders, and go all the way down through the arms, the hands, the hips, the knees, the ankles. Inhale deeply, exhale deeply. Inhale, smile, and exhale, release. And you can stay here as long as you need to with deep breath. And if you're done for the day, 
whenever you're ready, slowly open your eyes. And that's the workout today. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm going to see you on the next day. Bye-bye.